Here we are with Miss Maggie, and Miss Maggie is lucky enough to travel to Vancouver Island this weekend with her foster mummy. Maggie, are you excited? <laughs> so, I think so. Thank you, Kita, for helping us with Maggie. And um, so, what's next? Why are you taking Maggie back to Canada with you, and what are you going to do? She's uh, coming home with me. I'm going to foster her until we can find her a forever home. And are you in love? I'm so excited. She's are you going to so find beautiful. it hard to let her go to her yeah, forever it family? Be, it will be tough. She's so gorgeous and she's such a good girl, but I know there'll be a family that can keep her forever. And how do you think in, in Canada the, the mentality and the feelings towards pit bulls? What, what, what do people feel about pit bulls in Canada? Um, there's definitely the stereotypes, right? That mm -hmm. pit bulls aren't friendly and everything. And I'm hoping that we'll be able to break some barriers by um, bringing her to Port Alberni where she can meet some people face to face and they can see how beautiful she is and, and how much of a great asset they should be to their family. Oh, Maggie, Kida, congratulations. Thank you. Mariana, are you happy that she's leaving? Yes, I am very happy. Have you worked hard with, with Maggie? Has she had any behavior? She's just a very strong dog, but she's very obedient and very smart. She's very smart. Did you hear that, Maggie? She she's says you're smart. smart. And very sweet. She's very sweet. There's no bad pit bull, I believe. There's only bad owners. That's so. That's true. And at the moment at the sanctuary, you have a couple of pit bulls. Yes. What, is, what, is the, what is the chance of pit bulls getting adopted locally? It's not very easy because usually people here wants to breed them. Mm -hmm. So it's not very easy to get them up for adoption. Excellent work, Mariana. Congratulations, Kita. Hi, Carol. Another day, the SPCA way. Thank you.